it's Sean Roach here for Roach's Rant, uh, and I'm coming to you from uh, New York City. So I got uh, New York in the background coming from my hotel room. Um, look, one of the blog posts that we put together uh, a little while ago, and, and I say we because if you know anything about me, I'm severely dyslexic. So I come up with ideas, I talk about them, but I actually don't uh, write my blog posts. Um, I've got someone that helps me, with, helps me do that. And uh, it was ass versus asset, why your business needs an ass. And I figured New York's an appropriate place to actually make this video for you on Roach's Rant. Not because I think New Yorkers are ass asses. Um, I love New Yorkers because they're so forward and so direct. So that's why I'm doing this actually here. And why your business needs an ass is because too many businesses hire assets. They hire people that are saying things that the owner usually wants but you don't necessarily need that. Now, when I talk about bringing in an ass, I'm not talking about someone who's disrespectful and mean or any of those points. I'm talking about someone who can actually help your business, who can make a change in what you're actually trying to do. When I look at amazing luminaries like uh, Jeff Bezos, Steve Wynn, and the late Steve Jobs, all of them are known for being amazing within their business and amazing visionaries and luminaries, and at the same time, being an ass. Why? Because they speak the truth. They say exactly what's on their mind. They're not worried about the, pub, the uh, politically correct police. They're not worried about a trigger word or anything else. And they're not worried about hurting anyone's feeling because they're doing it for the pursuit of the betterment of the business. Anytime I come in and someone's like, wow, you were kind of an ass at that actual business. I don't worry about that because I'm here to help you as a business owner. I'm help anybody that I'm working with. I want to see that they bring on the right people within their team to make sure their business succeeds and goes to the next level. Whether it's an entrepreneur that's got a great idea, a solopreneur or a business owner, that's what I'm actually looking and wanting to do. So that's why I wanted to put this blog post together for you or this vlog, this video and show you that, you know what, sometimes you got to look at who you've actually hired and brought on because they may seem like they're the right person, but if they're not willing to tell Tell you the absolute honest truth they're not systematic in their thinking they're not afraid to tell you you know what you're going left but I really think you need to go right and I got to go down two steps I know you want to start with point one but I really think you need to start with point five if you don't bring someone in like that and have someone within your business you're gonna have major problems this is Sean Roach for Roach Rants